Hi everyone, uh, this topic will talk about login a uh, Logitech uh, LIP uh, backend router. So uh, LIP routers uh, we have uh, three main model versus uh, ME201, uh, then we have ME202 and ME204. Today's example will be based on ME204 and the purpose is uh, to convert the signal from backend IP to backend MSTP. And default IP address of uh, this Ethernet port is uh, 192.168.1.254 and here we will connect to the internet so the IP address uh, you will see will be different uh, later on and then uh, you can see the this is the uh, LIP uh, magnet router so you can see the display so if you want to modify some IP address manually you can just use the dial and check the I, uh, IP and some uh, further information over here then uh, come to the interface. Uh, these two Ethernet ports you can set either in the same IP address or different. Then uh, for different models, you will have the different uh, numbers of uh, MSTP connector. So as I mentioned, this one is uh, uh, ME204. Uh, so you will see we have the four channel uh, backnet MSTP connector. And one more thing I want to remind you that uh, for this uh, LIP backnet router, uh, you can supply uh, either a DC or uh, or AC or power source. But just uh, remember, uh, make sure the uh, correct uh, power. Uh, then we'll move to the login and basic uh, configuration. So first, uh, we if you want to do some configuration, just uh, click config. Then you will pump up this and. Uh, Account is a basic is a admin. Then the password default is for Loitech for you. And after that, uh, you can see the basic uh, informations. Then we can click the port uh, config. And as I mentioned, uh, because uh, this uh, device have a four backnet uh, MSTP port, so you will see here will show you port one to port four. And then you can set uh, for different port, you can set the different uh, protocol, means the different port rates and the not IDs, like etc. Then uh, here you will see another uh, Ethernet port. So, so for the Ethernet port, you can set uh, either uh, same IP address or individual IP address. Then uh, this example, we set uh, these two ports with a different IP address. Okay, then we switch to check the device information so you can see this is the product name and with the firmware version okay and you can see the CPU or status then also check the device uh, like uh, internet uh, port and uh, which uh, Ethernet you already connect so example we uh, use the uh, Ethernet 2 so you will see now it show link and for the Ethernet 1 because we did not connect so it was shown no link Okay, then we'll uh, move to the config. So as I mentioned here, we use the Logitech for you. Then uh, login. Okay, then click continue. So uh, this one is up to uh, your system uh, uh, layout. So you can modify to different uh, values and then for the port rates and also the maximum info frame and also for the network timing and next we move to the Ethernet so you can see here we set with the uh, different IP address and uh, we can also tick the function that we need okay so for example here we use the magnet IP so after you select what you need, then just uh, remember to set the settings. And then uh, one more thing I want to uh, mention here is uh, you can also do the firmware update online. So uh, you can check the firmware version, uh, latest firmware version online, then uh, click the stop update over here. And the last uh, function I want to mention over here is the packet capture function. So basically uh, you can uh, depends on which uh, ports that you want to get the packet for analyze then you can click uh, like this so you will capture and then uh, you can 
uh, stop and uh, download the capital function uh, basically uh, were exactly same as uh, you use a Wireshark so you can analyze the packet so that's all for today's topic thank you